good series today. Mm -hmm. Can you talk me through in terms of your, your opening round? Um, I mean, I was um, kind of prepared for um, the possibility of it taking me all three throws to get through to the finals. You know, I haven't competed since our national championship, which is well over a month now. Um, so I'm, I'm happy um, that I, I was able to get all three throws and, you know, get the big Q. Um, and like I said, um, it was kind of expected that it was going to take me all three throws to, you know, get the automatic qualifier. And overall, I'm happy with it. Was it kind of anxious being probably the last of the individual competitors to, co to kind of compete this late um, in the championships? Um, I wasn't anxious. The biggest concern for me was, um, you know, the the morning session and, you know, having to be up early because, you know, if the competition starts at, at 10.25, you know, you have to be here at least two or three hours before the competition starts. So for me, that was the biggest concern. Um, like I said, I was prepared knowing that it would possibly take me all three throws that, you know, kind of get the body, you know, woken up and, and ready to roll. What's the expectation now? Um, you are in the final. What is your expectation? What are you looking forward to? Um, anything is possible, you know. Um, the biggest goal was to get through this first part of it. Um, and then you know, you know, be prepared for the next part. So, you know, we've essentially since the national championship been preparing to, you know, be able to replicate what we do in the morning. So I think for me it's a big positive that I was able to throw over 19 meters in this morning session. So now I just gotta go back, rest up, and be ready for later. You said anything's possible. Um, you, you seem to have progressed steadily over the years, and you set a PB earlier this year. Do you think you might need to improve that to get a medal? Um, definitely. I think um, all the ladies out there, I know they're going to bring their A game. Um, so it's just whoever is more prepared for this afternoon, I think will essentially be, you know, at the top of the podium. The PB this season was a good indicator of where I am. Um, I'm not going to dwell on that, but it would be nice to get another PB for the championship. Whether it puts me on the podium or not, um, that would be, you know, a, a, a big plus for me. You've got quite a, good, a record as a, a discus trial as well, but you haven't done any for two or three years. Have you pretty much put that on the shelf? You know, that's a funny <laughs> question. My coach and I have been discussing potentially um, doubling um, at the next World Championship. So, fingers crossed if all things go the way we want it to this season and possibly next season, then you'll probably see me back in the discus again. Fingers crossed. Yeah. The, does, the, yeah. does that give a lot of Jamaican excitement to, to double up for discus and, and shot for Hey, it, I mean, there's a lot of ladies out there who are doing it. Why not? You know, it, there's no limit on what we can do.